I went to an example of dividing by a decimal. Okay, now the question I want to do is 855 divided by at 0.7. Now, uh, I could divide by a, a decimal, uh, but I want to make life a little bit easier for myself. So I'm going to think about what fraction or what division sum is exactly the same as 855 divided by 0 0.7. And the way I can do this is by multiplying the top number and the bottom number by 10. If I multiply the top number by 10, I get 8,550. If I multiply the bottom number by 10, I get 7. So the answer to 855 divided by 0.7 is exactly the same answer as 8550 divided by 7. So now what I'm going to do is work out the easier of those two questions, 855, so 8550 divided by 7. I'll start by saying how many 7s uh, into 8, 8, uh, 1, remainder 1. And how many 7s go into 15? That will be 2, remainder 1. And how many 7s into 15 again go 2, remainder 1. Finally, how many 7s go into 10? That's 1, remainder 3. And I can write remainder 3 if I want to, or I can say 3 divided by, and because we're dividing by 7, uh, it's 3 sevenths. So 855 divided by 0 0.7 is exactly the same answer, 1,221 and 3 sevenths.